Hello and welcome. The floodlights are shining down here at the 80,000 capacity Lusail Stadium just to the north of Doha. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Sweden versus Wales. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And this confrontation is underway. And space to exploit, maybe. Augustinsson. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Opportunity and a fine stop. Well, they fancy a short one. Giving it a try and using his body to good effect. Forsberg Klasson and intercepts again opportunity it is oh good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted can he deliver it with accuracy and the problem not completely solved Terrific block there. Could be. And still danger here. Very clear who got the last touch. So a corner coming up. Chance maybe. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. But the goalkeeper angry with himself here. When you look at this again, there's two things wrong defensively about this. First of all, the goalkeeper should not be parrying it into a dangerous area, and the defenders have to be sharper to get to the knockdown. It's not good defending all round. And back underway, 1-0 it is. It did look on for them, but not to be. And well, he successfully got past him. Not a very good challenge, and he skips past his man. Big chance to get them on terms. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Intense pressure. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Joe Allen. Ethan Ampadu. Wasteful from Sweden. Ramsey can he put it in well he had a lot of ground to cover splendid save and a short corner here and he takes on the shot it could have been awkward for the goalkeeper throwing pressure here and another corner taken short takes the shot and keeping it out well, smuggled behind for another corner. Who's going to get on the end of it? Still not clear. Bale. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Well, we saw what he was trying and it very nearly came off for him. Well, we're talking inches here. That was a really good effort. He struck the ball so well. well nicely cut out. Well, totaling up. Or... Oh, what an opportunity. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end. 
So back underway here into the second half. And possibilities inside the box. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Emil Forsberg. Isaac. And into the last 30 minutes now. Ball back with Wales here. Lovely work to get past his man. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Isaac. Can they convert? It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look in. Gareth Bale. Bale puts it in. Couldn't keep the ball, Bale. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Well, the referee has taken note of his name and number. Well, I think he can count himself a bit unlucky there, but it was certainly a foul. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Well, a bad pass it was. Ramsey's lost the ball. Forsberg. And it's with Isaac. Alert defending. Davis. Now with Wilson. Moore. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. And the final whistle. Alas, it has gone awry for Wales in this one. Stuart, how would you sum up their performance? Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round.